Whoa! What are you doing up so early? I thought you didn't have class on Wednesdays. I don't, but I'm gonna follow Stacy to the library and see if I can figure out what she's been hiding. Operation Stacy's mom is in full effect. Why are you calling it Operation Stacy's mom? Because her name is Stacy. What else would I call it? Oh, good point. But there's just one flaw in your plan. What's that? How do you even know Stacy's going to the library right now? What'd you do, cyberstalk her? No. I texted Lauren earlier and asked her what Stacy was doing today. She said she didn't have class, but that she was going to the library in a bit. Oh. What does Stacy even do at the library? I mean, can she read? My guess is that she's going back to make sure she covers up the evidence from when she killed Scott last night. Maybe. Speaking of which, are you still hanging out with Sarah today? Uh, yeah, we're getting together after my class. Perfect. Find out what she knows about Stacy and see if she can tell you where she was last night. Okay, no problem. Okay, I gotta go. Stacy's leaving now. I'm gonna follow her, see if we can figure out what she's been up to. You talk to Sarah, get everything you need to know, and we'll meet back up here and compare. Compare what? Dick sizes? Yeah, dude, we're gonna compare dick sizes. No, of course not. You've had a really lot of homo tendencies lately. Just be more specific next time. Besides, you don't want to compare dick sizes with me. Why not? You'd lose. Whatever! Asshole. Well, I mean, first of all, I think Newton's contributions will nearly compare to what Einstein did for math. I'm not going to disagree with you on that one. E equals mc squared is really the only major contribution Einstein made to that one. Cinematic history is so cool. Who's your teacher? Zelza. How is he? He's good. You know, he gives off a Mr. Feeney type vibe. So you know he really cares about his students. I don't understand that reference at all. <laughs> what? How have you not seen Boy Meets World? Because I'm not a hipster. I love Boy Meets World. There was a marathon on last night, but I had to miss it. I know, I, I was watching it. Wait, why'd you have to miss it? Oh, I was at some cafe on campus. I was supposed to meet Stacy there for dinner, but then she bailed last minute. Oh, did she say why? She just said she had something important to go do. Around what time was that? 7.30? That's around the time Scott was killed. Come on, Steven. Don't tell me Ronnie has you convinced that Stacy's a killer too now. I mean, I love her, but honestly, I don't think she's smart enough to pull something like that off. And besides, Ronnie has a knack for accusing people. I thought he was looking at you as the killer. What happened to that? Don't look at me. I don't know. Guys? You would not believe the shit I just saw. Hear ye, hear ye. The bullshit is coming. <laughs> Can't use my own line against me. Just did. But seriously though, I just followed Stacy to the library and she was conducting some group on uh, some study group or debate type thing. What were they debating? Which Powerpuff girl they resemble most? 
Laura, <laughs> what happened to be nice? Sorry, bitchy habits die hard. Guys, Stacy isn't as dumb as she seems. She was leading some group in arithmetic or some bullshit. The whole dumb thing she's been doing is just an act. I think I'm gonna die. <sighs> okay, so what are we gonna do now? We need a plan. I think we just ask her about it straight up. Mm -mm. No, we have to be sly about this. If she's already lying about who she is now, then she could definitely be the killer too. We don't want her to know that we're onto her, you know? So how are we gonna get her over here? Let's tell her we're having an iCarly marathon. Airhead girls like her love that kind of stuff, right? Except she isn't an airhead. She's just pretending to be one so we don't suspect her as the killer. Oh yeah. Okay, let's just tell her we're gonna have a roommate meeting and we need her home in the library. Ooh, or we can tell her the RA is looking for her and she needs to come talk to her. Or she can just walk in like that. Hey, Stacy. Hey guys! Okay, What's up? cut the bullshit. We all know you're not the dumb blonde you pretend to be. Ronnie! What? She needs to know that we know. So... You guys figured it out? Yep, we sure did. So why'd you do it? I mean, you know, it's actually something that I do a lot. So this isn't your first killing spree? Killing spree? What the heck? I'm talking about method acting. <sighs> method acting? Yes! I am an actress! I thought that's what you guys were talking about. You're an actress, Stacy? Yeah! Um... Mm, okay. Another thing. My real name is not Stacy R. Evans. It's just an anagram that I made up from my real name, Carly Stevens. Oh, oh, Carly Stevens? No way! I knew I recognized you from somewhere. You were in Sorority Spring Break Sleepover House Party Massacre Part 2! Yeah! I, I was uh, Sorority Girl number two. Oh, you guys would not believe the amount of hazing that I went through to prepare for that role. So you're not actually dumb, you were just pretending this entire time? Yeah. You know, I'm actually really smart. This is blowing my mind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, good job. You had us all fooled. <laughs> I never suspected a thing. Yeah, same here. You're a great actress. I loved you as Keenan Thompson's love interest in Good Burger Part 2. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Ronnie. Speaking of burgers, I am so hungry. Um, do you guys want to go get food? I had a big breakfast. I'm good. Yeah, I'm not that hungry either. Same. I think we'll just stay here. I'm in. Alright. Well, later, guys. Peace. Bye. Hey, 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 where you guys headed? We're gonna go get some food. You wanna come? No, nah, I was probably just gonna watch some TV and smoke some weed. Okay. Well, you do that, bud. <laughs> bud, I get it. Like, like weed. <laughs> yeah, um, wasn't trying to make that joke, but... Okay, you have a good time, and we'll see you when we get back. Later, dude. Later. <laughs> Here you go, man. Nothing as satisfying as shoving that big burrito right in your mouth. Oh my god, you disgusting. All the like salsa you. everywhere. Who is that? Matt, I'm assuming. <laughs> no, that's not Matt. It's too short to be Matt. Let's check it out. Oh shit, let's go. Damn! Fuck, we were this close! Where the hell did he go? 
broad daylight. Hello? Yes, Mom. I'm still planning on coming home next weekend for my birthday. Look, Mom, okay, now is not really a good time. Okay, can I call you back later? Thanks. Love you too.